the compromise reached on July 1st of this year between the representatives of the Syro Malabar Catholic Bishop Synod and the laity of Ernaula Mangamali Archdiocese was a positive step indeed. There were two main points of contention that was discussed and settled. One was the introduction of the Synodal Mass in the Archdiocese. The other was the ordination of the deacons which has been held up from December 2023. As agreed, Synodal Mass has been introduced to most of the parish churches in the Archdiocese. But the Synod has thus far refused to honor its parts of the bargain. They are still refusing to ordain the deacons as was agreed upon. Now, in a not so surprising move, the Apostolic Administrator Mark Bosco Putu has declared that he is withdrawing from the July 1st Accord, thereby refusing the ordination of the deacons. Naturally, Almaya Muneta, who is fighting on behalf of the deacons and the laity of the Archdiocese, has responded harshly. They have requested those parish priests who offer Holy Mass in the synodal mode to discontinue the practice effective immediately. Mr. Shaiju Anthony, the convener of Almaya Munnetam, declared that the faithful are very upset and angry by the betrayal of Maputur. They are ready for strong action against the authorities, he said. There will be pickets, there will be demonstrations and rallies in the coming days. The fight will continue unabated until the deacons are ordained, he insisted. He further demanded that the administrative offices of the Archdiocese be shut down completely. And he also demanded the members of the Curia should resign their positions. Why do we need a dysfunctioning bureaucracy in our Archdiocese, he asked. The refusal of the Synod to ordain the deacons is highly controversial. The Synod insists the deacons should submit an affidavit affirming they will only offer the Synodal Mass as a condition for ordination. The deacons vehemently reject this. They say no priest currently serving in the Archdiocese is bound by any such rule. As per the July 1st agreement, the priests of the diocese are bound to say one Synod Mass on Sundays and days of obligation. Only this should be applicable to them also, insist the deacons. Meanwhile, the clergy and the faithful of the Archdiocese accuse the Synod of blackmailing these deacons. Of course, they and their families are clearly distressed. And members of the Arnaula Mangamali Archdiocese demand immediate resolution to this problem, to this matter. Now that the July 1st Accord is practically dead, things are going to get more messy in the Archdiocese. A direct papal intervention seems to be the only solution to these problems. Thank you very much.